Jehovah's Witnesses False Prophecies Fake Paradise Earth Hope John 14 verse 2 In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. Nasb version says, In my Father's house are many dwelling places. If it were not so, I would have told you, for I go to prepare a place for you. The word for mansion is mu omicron nutamamane. It means a dwelling, an abode. John 8 verse 12. 12 Then spake Jesus again unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Matthew 22 verse 30. For in the resurrection they neither marry, nor are given in marriage, but are as the angels of God in heaven. Revelation 21 verse 23. And the city had no need of the sun, neither of the moon, to shine in it, for the glory of God did lighten it, and the Lamb Jesus Christ is the light thereof. Revelation 22 verse 5. 5 And there shall be no night there, and they need no candle, neither light of the sun, for the Lord God giveth them light, and they shall reign forever and ever. Hebrews 11 verse 16. But now they desire a better country, that is, and heavenly. Wherefore God is not ashamed to be called their God, for he hath prepared for them a city. Hebrews 11 verses 13 to 16. 13 These all died in faith, not having received the promises, but having seen them afar off, and were persuaded of them, and embraced them, and confessed that they were strangers and pilgrims on the earth. 14 For they that say such things declare plainly that they seek a country. 15 And truly, if they had been mindful of that country from whence they came out, they might have had opportunity to have returned. 16 But now they desire a better country, that is, and heavenly. Wherefore God is not ashamed to be called their God, for he hath prepared for them a city. 2 Corinthians 12 verse 4 How that he was caught up into paradise and heard unspeakable words, which it is not lawful for a man to utter. Luke 23 verse 43 And Jesus said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, Today shalt thou be with me in paradise. God Father Holy Spirit Jesus Christ does not dwell in temples made with hands. Acts 7 verses 48 and 49 Howbeit the Most High dwelleth not in temples made with hands, as saith the prophet, Heaven is my throne and earth is my foot's tool, what house will ye build me saith the Lord, or what is the place of my rest? John 2 verses 19 to 21 Jesus answered and said unto them, Destroy this temple, and in three days I will raise it up. 20 Then said the Jews, Forty and six years was this temple in building, and wilt thou rear it up in three days? 21 But he spake of the temple of his body. 1 Corinthians 6 verse 15 15 Know ye not that your bodies are the members of Christ? Shall I then take the members of Christ, and make them the members of an harlot? God forbid. 1 Corinthians 6 verse 19 19 What? Know ye not that your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost which is in you, which ye have of God, and ye are not your own? Matthew 22 verse 30 for in the resurrection they neither marry, nor are given in marriage, but are as the angels of God in heaven. Jehovah's Witness locked out of heaven. False fake paradise earth hope fake 1914 Jesus Christ invisible presence or secret chamber false prophets. Matthew 24 Wherefore if they shall say unto you, Behold, he is in the desert, go not forth, behold, he is in the secret chambers, believe it not. Revelation 1 verses 7 to 9. 7 Behold, he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him, and all kindreds of the earth shall wail because of him. Even so, Amen. 8 I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the ending, saith the Lord, which is, and which was, and which is to come, the Almighty. 9 I John, who also am your brother, and companion in tribulation, and in the kingdom and patience of Jesus Christ, was in the isle that is called Patmos, for the word of God, and for the testimony of Jesus Christ. Matthew 24 verse 27 For as the lightning cometh out of the east, and shineth even unto the west, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man.
Psalm 146 verses 3 to 5. 3. Put not your trust in princes, nor in the Son of Man, in whom there is no help. For his breath goeth forth, he returneth to his earth, and that very day his thoughts perish. 5. Happy is he that hath the God of Jacob for his help, whose hope is in the Lord his God. 1 Corinthians 15 verses 20 to 55. 20. But now is Christ risen from the dead, and become the first fruits of them that slept. 21. For since by man came death, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. 22. For as in Adam all die, even so in Christ shall all be made alive. 23. But every man in his own order, Christ the first fruits, afterward they that are Christ said his coming. 24. Then cometh the end, when he shall have delivered up the kingdom to God, even the Father, when he shall have put down all rule and all authority and power. 25. For he must reign, till he hath put all enemies under his feet. 26. The last enemy that shall be destroyed is death. 27. For he hath put all things under his feet. But when he saith all things are put under him, it is manifest that he is accepted, which did put all things under him. 28. And when all things shall be subdued unto him, then shall the Son also himself be subject unto him that put all things under him, that God may be all in all. 29. Else what shall they do which are baptized for the dead? If the dead rise not at all, why are they then baptized for the dead? 30. And why stand we in jeopardy every hour? 31. I protest by your rejoicing which I have in Christ Jesus our Lord, I dry daily. 32. If after the manner of men I have fought with beasts at Ephesus, what advantage hath it me, if the dead rise not? Let us eat and drink, for tomorrow we die. 33. Be not deceived, evil communications corrupt good manners. 34. Awake to righteousness, and sin not, for some have not the knowledge of God, I speak this to your shame. 35. But some man will say, How are the dead raised up? And with what body do they come? 36. Thou fool, that which thou sowest is not quickened, except to die. 37. And that which thou sowest, thou sowest not that body that shall be, but bare grain, it may chance of wheat, or of some other grain. 38. But God giveth it a body as it hath pleased him, and to every seed his own body. 39. All flesh is not the same flesh, but there is one kind of flesh of men, another flesh of beasts, another of fishes and another of birds. 40. There are also celestial bodies, and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. 41. There is one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon, and another glory of the stars, for one star differeth from another star in glory. 42. So also is the resurrection of the dead. It is sown in corruption, it is raised in incorruption. 43. It is sown in dishonor, it is raised in glory, it is sown in weakness, it is raised in power. 44. It is sown a natural body, it is raised a spiritual body. There is a natural body, and there is a spiritual body. 45. And so it is written, the first man Adam was made a living soul, the last Adam was made a quickening spirit. 46. How be it that was not first which is spiritual, but that which is natural and afterward that which is spiritual. 47 The first man is of the earth, earthy, the second man is the Lord from heaven. 48 As is the earthy, such are they also that are earthy, and as is the heavenly, such are they also that are heavenly. 49 And as we have borne the image of the earthy, we shall also bear the image of the heavenly. 50 Now this I say, brethren, that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God. Neither doth corruption inherit in corruption. 51 Behold, I show you a mystery, we shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed. 52 In a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, for the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. 53 For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. 54 So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, Death is swallowed up in victory. 55 O death, 
Where is thy sting? O grave, where is thy victory? 56 The sting of death is sin, and the strength of sin is the law.